If you need to figure out which fraction is greater, 3 eighths or 4 fifths, here's how you can do that. So we need to find a common denominator, something that both 8 and 5 go into evenly. So we could say if we multiply 8 times 5, that would give us 40. And then down here, we could multiply 5 times the 8. And that would also give us 40. So now we have a common denominator. We just need to figure out the numerators and compare those. Whichever is greater, that'll be the greater fraction between 3 eighths and 4 fifths. So up here, since we multiplied the denominator by 5, we also have to multiply the numerator by 5. That's because 5 divided by 5 equals 1. We're just multiplying 3 eighths by 1. So we don't change the value, just the way it's represented. 3 times 5, that's 15. And 15 fortieths, that's an equivalent fraction to 3 eighths. They have the same value. Down here, we multiply the denominator by 8. Let's multiply the numerator by 8. 8 over 8 is 1. We're just multiplying by 1 again. 4 times 8 is 32. And now, since the denominators, these are the same, we can just compare the numerators. And you can clearly see that 32, that's larger than 15. What that means is that the fraction 4 fifths that's going to be greater than 3 eighths. So in answer to our question, 4 fifths is greater than 3 eighths. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.